Okay, so welcome to another episode of Bangalid Vepadda. Okay, so uh, what we are going to do is we are going to review another e liquid today. You can already see it. Uh, this is uh, from Lichen Bastard. Okay, you can see it. This is from Lichen Bastard, and the flavor is vanilla caramel tobacco. All right, so this is what we are going to review today from Lichen Bastard. Now, when I started vaping, you know, uh, I tried like <laughs> thousands of uh, Nixols, uh, but I did not like any one of it. Okay, fruit flavors, mints, menthols, I did not like any one of it. Then I stumbled upon uh, VCT, Vanilla Custard Tobacco of Rye Vapes, and still now, uh, that is my all-day vape, but as the time passing by, I am um, being uh, dragged towards pure tobacco flavors more and more. Okay, uh, so like this is by Lichen Bastard, and this is vanilla caramel tobacco. So uh, actually, this is a kind of a RY4. Okay, so I love RY4s. Okay, now what we are going to do is uh, we are going to try it on my very powerful device this is okay this is smock mag 225 okay uh, one hell of a monster this is smock mag 225 okay very powerful okay so let's first quickly set it up all right fresh coils okay uh, sorry about the noise Okay. This is V12 T10 Prince coils. Okay. V12 T10 Prince coil. These are very, very powerful coils. These are. Okay. So, this is what we are going to use. And this is best for uh, 60 to 120 watts. Okay. Now, what we are going to do is, as you all know, we are going to prime it. Okay. Two things when you are using e liquids or you're using mods, pods, or DIYs, two things are very important, okay? Priming your coil and steeping your e-liquids, okay? So priming, I'm going to show you, okay? And steeping is very simple. When you buy an e-liquid, don't just, uh, uh, I mean, immediately come home and crack open the bottle and start vaping on it. What you need to do is, let it stay sealed, all right? And while it is sealed, it is recommended for at least two weeks or at least seven days, keep that sealed e-liquid bottle in a, a dark place where there is no sunlight, dark and cool place. And once every day, just bring the bottle out and give it a good shake, all right? Without breaking the seal, that is, give it a good shake and then put it back. Second day, do the same. Third day, do the same. Fourth day, do the same. What happens is when you do this, all the chemicals, VG, PG and uh, nicotines and flavors, they all bind together and it gives you the exact flavor, the way the liquid should taste. All right. So let's prime the coil. Okay. I'm going to stand up. Okay. Now take a look. These are the pocket holes you can see. So we need to couple of drop of liquid okay all right okay and a couple of drops inside all right yeah that's it okay now let's join it here the coil will go here okay All right. a bit more and then the tank and the drip top all right you close it here okay nice and tight okay it's done and you open this all right and this is where you 
fill up your liquid all right so let's fill it up done okay new coil so i will uh, keep it as it is for 15 minutes all right and after 15 minutes once the coil is well saturated we will vape on it all right so smoke mag 225 and lichen bastards vanilla caramel tobacco so it's ready okay it's been 15 minutes and you can see on the back the cloud all right okay beautiful isn't it your vape the rain <laughs> okay now uh, so it's a new coil all right it's been 15 minutes so i will start with uh, low uh, wattage okay the airflow is wide open okay right here all right It has got its uh, this uh, very earthy texture to it. Uh, uh, a bit of uh, throat hit, okay, uh, which I like. Okay, it, it gives you throat hit. Anyways, this is a monster. All right, smoke back to twenty five. Okay, so uh, this is uh, smooth on inhale, smooth on exhale. All right. It has a uh, straight way when you inhale, you get that RD note, okay? Uh, that RD uh, leathery kind of a note, okay? And when you exhale, you get that hint of caramel, okay? Which binds the flavor, but I, I didn't uh, get any uh, vanilla on this one, okay? So I'm getting a RD tobacco note when I'm inhaling, and when I'm exhaling, I'm getting that uh, hint of caramel which binds this flavor profile but no vanilla at least for me yeah uh, 60 40 vgpg so good vape, vapor production as well okay so when you inhale uh, you will immediately feel uh, that sweetness on your tongue. It has got a beautiful sweetness. All right. Uh, let's increase uh, the wattage a bit. All right. Let's go to 65. And let's see if we can find out something else on 65. Let's see if we can find out the vanilla. Okay. It is on 65. Okay. All right, Vanilla, where are you? No. I'm not getting that vanilla. But, I mean, not bad. On, on a weather, uh, on a day of this kind, with this kind of weather, uh, I mean, uh, these are a good kind of vapes. Uh, maybe I would prefer it with a cup of coffee. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. So uh, that's it. That's about it from uh, Bangalir Vepadda. Okay. So we will see you pretty soon on another video, maybe with a review of uh, e-liquid uh, with uh, uh, Nick Salt or a device or maybe a disposable. You never know, though. I don't like it and uh, uh yeah so and that's it uh, stay healthy stay fit take care of your family and uh, vape responsibly right take care bye bye